What is that? You gotta fight! Oh, I gotta go. Bye. Woo! Woo! Come on! You got to be kidding me! I don't know what it is. Good luck, that's a live one. Good morning, friends. January 2nd, 2023. Yes, 2023 is here. And it is the first day of bluefin season here in the Outer Banks. Something very interesting happening this morning. Instead of going straight out through the Oregon Inlet, we're going to be going down the Pamlico Sound. We're headed to Hatteras. And so instead of going out the Oregon Inlet and heading south that way, we're now going to go straight through the sound. It's going to save us probably about 40 miles each way. We may be in Hatteras for a couple of days. They say that's where they think the fish are, but there ain't much fish yet. There's not many people fishing for bluefin yet. So we're one of the first ones out here. We're crossing our fingers. We're just hoping to get some magic and we're following uh, a good buddy, Jimmy from the Hog Wild, he's allowing us to follow him this morning through the sound because we have done it before. And so the professor is definitely, definitely feeling it this morning, our first time. Doing a lot of new things on this trip. And so we're really, really excited. We're really hopeful. We're a little bit nervous. And we're gonna take you along the journey. Get a bunch of slack. You know what I mean? 
everything will come tight, no good slide, charge, and it's all done. As soon as the train gets clear there, yes. we're going to move to that one. You let me know, I'll help you. Get ready to do it, okay? Right. Oops. 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 There we go. Oh! Damn, Ron! Okay. Thank you. Remember that, it's gotta be 73 inches. <laughs> we're gonna need to get all the gas out of the engine room, Trent. That small one ain't gonna work. Color! It is a bluefin now? You sure yeah. it's a bluefin, not a... Yeah. Yeah. Do we need to, uh... No, not yet. At least try to it. measure it? Right. Get that measuring tape out. What do you think, 50 inches? Easy run! He's kicking it easy, let's get him on hook. He's good, we can get him on hook. Ah, right, first release of the year. So that was crazy. We've been trolling for 45 minutes, I guess. And we're in these shallow waters and we just got us our first bluefin of the season. Obviously it was not a keeper. Uh, Doug, how big do you think it was? Uh, I'm probably about 125. 125 pounds. Yeah. Inch wise, what, 60 some inches probably? Uh, yeah, he's gonna be in upper 50. Upper 50, yeah. So. Probably, probably right around 60 inches is was that fish. It got to be 73 to keep. Nonetheless, we were thrilled to to know that we're in an area where potentially we could catch. Uh, very, very exciting. Very cool. Never, never dreamed of catching bluefin tunas. Literally a couple miles offshore. We're in cell phone range. I mean, it's just wild. So good start for the speechless. Let's see where we go. Let's see what happens for the rest of the day. Cinderella bite, but what a day it was. Beautiful day. I can't believe it. January 2nd. T-shirts on. I mean, it's just, it's just crazy. Our day started off. What time did you wake up? Uh, 2.30. 2.30. I woke up around the same time. Yeah. We left, ended up leaving the marina around 3.30. Took about two and a half hours to get to Hatteras yeah. from Pirate's Cove. Right. And then Roughly another hour to the fishing grounds, uh, thereabouts, yep. you say? Yeah. We got blessed with an early, unbelievable bluefin bite. I mean, yeah. right out the gate. Yeah. 
So that was really, really cool, unexpected. And from what we heard in the fleet today, I think we were one of the only ones in the entire like Eastern, like between North Carolina, South Carolina, you know, I don't think many people got blueprints today. I think it was like four caught down off a boat today. Yeah. Kind of like 50 boats. And there's two boats here and each one of us caught a fish today, but they get that to be a little more short. Yeah, just, just have to be short. And certainly we appreciate little Jimmy on the whole while. He allowed us to follow him down here. And you've probably seen all Wicked Tuna, but he's an amazing guy, certainly a great charter. So if you want to have a great charter experience, that's one that you should certainly consider if you're coming out here to the Outer Banks. Got us a king mackerel today, saw a million spade fish. Yeah, you know, at one time. Yeah, I mean, that was cool. You know, so it was a completely different type of fishing than I've ever done in shallow waters. Fishing for big game is pretty wild. It is pretty wild. Yeah, we saw some big food that was in the water, take some bait, and that was really cool. We've been waiting for that all day long. So. Yeah, just didn't, just didn't materialize. We know where we're coming tomorrow morning, and so we're excited about that. And we're excited for you, of course, to join us the rest of this season. It's going to be an amazing, amazing year, and we're glad you're a part of it. And so make sure you like it. Make sure you subscribe. Do all the things. Come see us. Pirates Cove Marina, slip number 92. And until the next time, everyone, stay salty.